Uh, complete action figure near mint. That's dumb. Start over. YouTube, I'm back from vacation. Two weeks I was gone. Where was I? I was in Jakarta, Indonesia, Bali, Indonesia, and in Tokyo. And I went on toy hunts and my hair's a mess because I have been awake for 30 straight hours getting back. I just got back today. We left Tokyo at 6.30 p.m. Tokyo time. And all the hour changes to get me back here, we got back around 2.30 p.m. here in the Pacific Northwest. But yeah, I went toy hunting. I found some stuff. Those videos will be coming out soon. This weekend, uh, coming up, I'm going to see The Phantom Menace back in theaters. I'm doing a whole video on that as well. It should be released this Sunday. Uh, I'm going to take a look at all the uh, Phantom Menace toys that I have in my collection. I just got some in the mail as well, so I'll put all those together, do a big compilation on the Phantom Menace, and going to see it in the theaters. If you haven't seen, I've got a Chewbacca video that just came out last Sunday, and the thumbnail will be right here. And that's about everything that's Chewbacca in my collection currently. It's a focus on that. There was a Bosque one as well that came out. There's that one. We had a mail haul video that came out right there. All those links are down below in the description. Make sure to check all those videos out. I'm going to probably have another mail haul video uh, coming out again soon because I have a pile of stuff here from the two weeks I was gone that all got mailed into me. I checked everything. It's all good. I've got some stuff from CAS that's come back as well. So we'll do a big video on that uh, coming up maybe in the next couple of weeks. Um, before you do anything, Please support me in the free way that you can by liking, subscribing, and hitting that bell notification so you're notified of all upcoming videos, which there will be tons of. So you might as well hit it, and a little link will pop up on your phone that says, hey, uh, Star Wars Daddy's got a new video that's come out. But besides all that, the trip went awesome. Uh, if you haven't seen all the shorts, uh, I'm still compiling some and releasing some shorts. Make sure to check all those shorts out. You'll see my entire vacation with Yoda. Yoda came with me. He was everywhere. People were snickering. They were watching us while we were uh, making videos. They were asking what we were doing. Lots of conversations happened on this vacation, all surrounded around Yoda and uh, his adventures in Asia. But today, we are back doing our eBay listing videos. I had posted a bunch on eBay before I left so that they'd end the day before I got home, which was yesterday on Sunday, because uh, today is Monday that I'm actually filming this. I'm going to ship all these out. We had 29 items go out for $750. And I don't know what that average is out, but I'll put the average right here. And I think it's going to be close to like $25 or somewhere around there. So it's, I'm okay with that. These are just pretty common items. Nothing spectacular. We'll probably do a feature on one of the figures in here um, just so we can get some more information about where it came from, different COOs, where was this person in the movies, uh, just to give a little bit of extra background around all these figures. But enough of all that. Let's get into the video. Fire out of South Carolina picked up the X-Wing Luke Skywalker complete in pretty nice condition. Hong Kong COO, $20.50. Joel is a repeat buyer out of Massachusetts. Picked up my IG-88 complete Hong Kong COO, $20.50. Clifton is a repeat buyer out of Texas. Picked up two items from me tonight. The General Maydeen complete Taiwan in near mint condition for $34. That's a great price. And a Stormtrooper Hoth version with the split visor, complete. 
Uh, 26 bucks. That one, not so good. Glenn is a repeat buyer out of California, picked up that Rebel Soldier with the Painted Legs variant. It was in pretty nice condition for $18.50. Hey, Bozo, do a feature on the Ugnaught. Mm. Ugnaughts were a species of porcine, sentient humanoids native to the planet Gentis. They were considered by many to be among the hardest working species in the galaxy. Mark is a repeat buyer out of Rhode Island. Picked up uh, the feature we just showed of the Ugnaught with the purple smock, Hong Kong COO, complete $21.50, and also the AT AT driver with the orange logos, uh, complete Hong Kong COO, $16.66. Chris is a repeat buyer out of New Jersey, picked up two items. Got the Walrus Man with the white tusk, complete in near mint condition for $26, and a Bespin Han Solo complete for $22.50. Both of those are great prices for me. Rick is a repeat buyer out of Colorado, picked up two items, a Bespin Luke Skywalker who was complete in very nice condition for $42, and a C-3PO, which I assume had real floppy limbs for the starting bid price of $10. Nate is a repeat buyer out of Nevada, picked up my Jawa with the small eyes, near complete and just missing that blaster. Um, pretty nice condition for $20.50. Joshua is a repeat buyer out of California, picked up three items from me this evening. A Darth Vader complete in near mint condition. Uh, most of the tip was gone. There was a little bit of the tip of the saber still left for $22.50. A Hoth Han Solo complete in very nice condition for $14.50. And a Bosk in near mint condition. This guy was great, but only went for $13.51. He's on Banger Lane. Jason's a repeat buyer out of New Mexico. Picked up the highest price item of the evening. It's the Bespin Princess Leia complete in near mint condition for $69.55. My boy Damon out of Missouri picked up the Lando Calrissian complete with those teeth in near mint condition for $22.50. Thank goodness Lando sold for a decent price this week. Don't push any luck. William's a repeat buyer out of Pennsylvania. Lots of repeat buyers. I think it's uh, all repeat buyers until like the very end, uh, which is great. I appreciate all of that support. We got a Dangar that nobody cares about. Dangar uh, and Lobot and the previous Lando and a whole bunch of other figures. Nobody seems to care about. This guy was in mint condition complete, only $13. And an 88 with, I don't know, the circles on the hips. I didn't look at it. And I already sealed it up in the package. So uh, who knows, but uh, in pretty nice condition for also uh, $13.50. So low-priced items. Wait, is David a repeat? Are we now into the no repeats? Okay, we're... Oh, Stephen wasn't a repeat buyer. Wasn't No. Let me re... Hey, redo Yoda. Redo Yoda. I'm just going to do it. Where was he out of? Yes. No, That's Indiana. Indiana. <laughs> oh, what's his name? Steven. Oh, I already lost it. How much did I go for? The, the oh, I'm just going to go back to it right here. I'll guess. Oh, so st oh, come on. It's not in the order. Oh, my gosh. Thanks, eBay. You can't find Yoda? You can't find Yoda. God, you're so stupid. Holy cow, I've sold a ton of Yodas. Steven out of Indiana is a new buyer. Appreciate that. Picked up the Yoda, missing the cane, but in near mint condition. All for $36. And don't forget to go check out all of my shorts of the travels of Yoda to Asia on the vacation I just got back from. Lots of shorts and more of them to come. I'm going to be working on them all week. They're going to be awesome. What? He's not. He wouldn't know anything about anything. <laughs> 
David is a new buyer out of Pennsylvania. Picked up two items from me this evening. The Rebel Commander in near mint condition and complete for $22.50. And an FX7 that no one seems to want with the orange eye, $12.50. Oops. No, but this is a new buyer. No. Let's start over. Tom is... Tom is a new buyer out of someplace international because this item is going to the eBay seller hub. And he picked up a Chewbacca complete in pretty good condition for only $16.50. I would assume the shipping that he's paying is more than the actual action figure. David is a repeat buyer out of Iowa, picked up that hammerhead. We all love that hammy in mint condition complete, $31. Brandon is a new buyer out of Michigan. Picked up my Tauntaun with the closed belly. It was complete, but had a snap in the reins, I think in two spots. One right in the mouth uh, piece, and then one on the uh, the backside. But uh, that went for $19.50. Oh. What just happened? It got all crumpled up. I'm gonna have to redo that one. What's happening? What the f you? What the f you? Okay, that's it. What a quick, short little video, right to the point. Like I said, I've been on vacation for two weeks. I have been up for 30 straight hours. I cannot wait to go to bed tonight. But we got these things knocked out. There was only 29 items, 750 bucks. It comes to like $26 per item, which is just fine because you, as you can see, lots of common figures in there, nothing super special but uh, just some stuff to kind of get some cash flow back in. But coming up this Sunday, make sure you check out the short, it's right here. This will show you all the items that are gonna be up for sale this Sunday that are already active. And there are some bangers in there, you gotta check it out, make sure you bid, and uh, hopefully you'll get some shout outs coming up this Sunday. Uh, when you win some of my items. And make sure to check out all the shorts of Yoda's adventures while he was on vacation with me. There's some funny stuff that's in there. You'll see some epic locations. Check those out. They're all right in here. Make sure you click those, watch those, like those, do everything you can to those that is appropriate. Again, hopefully I'm gonna have the Phantom Menace video coming up this Sunday. If not, I'll throw something else in there if I just don't have enough time to get it all edited. I got a lot of editing to do with this video, that video coming up. I got some shorts that I'm putting in. So lots of work happening here with the Star Wars Daddy. Please make sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, that helps me. It brings people that have not found me to me so we can build a community here. I really appreciate all of the support and it looks like I survived. So until the next time, who's still your daddy? Nate is a repeat buyer out of him. Complete in near mint condition. This guy was in, in awesome. Well, he was near mint. Uh, I kind of already described it. Uh, there's not much else because they're always the Hong Kong CEO and near mint. God, this one was a bust. <laughs> All right. Be complete. You idiot. Of course he's complete. I wouldn't sell him if he's missing an arm. <sighs> Try again.